another tobacco review. Lovely day here today in Christchurch. Um, sitting on my front step here, as you can see. Not that you know it's my front, but I can tell you that it is. So I'm just sitting in the sun, getting a nice bit of warmth. Um, had a bit of a cold snap lately, so it's a beautiful day out here today. Now there is a bit of wind around, so that's why I've got you nestled in here. Hopefully it's um, out of the wind uh, today. Without further ado, here is the tobacco in question today. Suj Gunjin, God of Samurai. Now this is a premium pipe tobacco again. I uh, did the God of Thunder last week. This one here is also made by Mark Ryan. It is a um, Virginia based, it's not a straight vapour. Um, and it's blended by Drew Estate, um, a country of origin is US, and uh, I'm just going to tell you about it. Oh, the cut is, uh, it's, it's, well I'd say it's a mixture of, mixture cut really, and consisting of Cavendish, Perique and Virginia. I will be smoking it today in my Boswells, little, uh, I don't know. I think I've said this before, I would say it's a squash tomato, lovely little pipe, nice uh, chunky grain on it as is often the case with these guys, nice colour on the stem. And this is uh, 2007, nice old pipe, it smokes really well and uh, love it. I love it in hand, feels great. Um, the strength of this one here, oh, before I start, I've read some reviews on all these four releases of the did of these uh, God of Such and Such series, um, and undoubtedly this particular one was the, the top rated one, and that's why I only, I only purchased, I think it was a 14 special when I got two of this and two of the God of Thunder. So, um, so anyway, the strength of this is it's medium. Squashed. The uh, taste or flavour is medium, and the room note I would say is tolerable. Okay. Um, Let's get right on with it. Got it paired today with a lovely strong cup of coffee and this on that note this pairs beautifully with uh, coffee so keep that in mind. Very nice. Um, this packed well out straight out of the tin. I find it for the most part um, stays, stays lit very well. It's a, it's a good vapour. Um, I use the word vapour loosely because I wouldn't say it's not, it's not a straight vapour and it's certainly not a straight Virginia so that Cavendish just gives a nice wee twist so it's um, very light on the preak um, which actually works it's only slightly uh, only got has slight hints of a spice um, sort of felt at the back of the palate when you're smoking All in all, I, f I find this blend um, to be very, very well balanced. Um, it's not too sweet, it's not too spicy. In the word, words of uh, Goldilocks, it's uh, just right. Toward the end of my life, I'll have a little bit. Um, it's reasonably consistent uh, right through the smoke, right to the bottom of the bowl. I find it a, it's a cool smoke, um, but on that note it can get a little warm if pushed. Burns down to a lovely um, nice white ash. Um, all in all it's very nice and I think I gave the God of Thunder a three and a half. I'll, 
this one here. Four. I give this one a four out of five, and, uh, and deservedly so. I'm looking forward to um, selling this. I think that it might, this one, of all of them, I think it's going to actually sell well. At least better than the rest. Very nice smoke. Um, it's a nice and cool. Check it out. I like it. Hope you do too. Anyway, I'm just going to carry on sipping my coffee here and bask up in these lovely sun. Uh, I hope this finds you all very well and uh, enjoying a smoke perhaps. And uh, until we meet again next week, um, keep them smoky. And as always, hang loose everyone. See you next week.